the early 1930s, the National Socialist Political Party in Germany, also known as the Nazis, began amassing power and popular support throughout the country. Their leader, Adolf Hitler, was a charismatic orator who became Chancellor of Germany in January of 1933. A chancellor is similar to a president, although in this case Hitler had total control of Germany. Dachau is located just outside Munich, one of the major cities of Germany, and is also the location of the Nazi headquarters. Dachau concentration camp was opened in 1933 by Heinrich Himmler, only a few months after Hitler formally took power. Himmler was one of Hitler's closest advisors and shared Hitler's beliefs. These Nazis had originally established a camp to imprison political enemies. Political enemies are people who oppose the government and the policies of Hitler and the Nazis. If anyone tried to say, Hitler must be stopped, or Hitler should stop his plans, or Hitler is a racist, they would be considered a political prisoner and taken to Dachau. At this point, the camp could hold around 5,000 prisoners. When these political prisoners entered the camp, they saw the, the phrase, Arbeit macht frei, which is German for, work will make you free. The Nazis wanted their prisoners to think that they could work their way to freedom. However, this was actually a cruel joke, and the vast majority of prisoners eventually died. The camp itself was surrounded by large metal gates all around to prevent the prisoners from escaping. There were also tall guard towers, which would watch the prisoners and shoot any that tried to escape or disobey orders. By 1935, the prison expanded and now accepted other undesirable prisoners, like Jehovah's Witnesses and homosexuals. As time went on, Dachau continued to accept more and more prisoners and continued to expand. By the 1940s, the camp had ballooned from 5,000 prisoners to over 12,000. The imprisoned now include Jews from all over Europe, especially Poland. These prisoners were identified by the patches they wore in their prison outfits. Jews wore yellow, homosexuals pink, and political enemies wore black. Inside the camp, the prisoners were subjected to forced labor. They were either forced to expand the camp by building houses and digging trenches, or they had to work in factories assembling bullets, bombs, and other weapons of war. By 1945, ovens were constructed on the grounds of Dachau to burn those who died in the camp. By burning the bodies, the Nazis could hide their atrocities from the world. However, today we know just how horrific life was in these camps. In April of 1945, the Americans liberated the camp. The population had swelled at this point as 30,000 prisoners were released and freed. Over the 12 years that Dachau operated, over 200,000 prisoners were taken there, with over 40,000 recorded deaths.